mission today is to distill a big bunch of rosemary and hopefully achieve 10 mils of essential oil. So I'm all set up here. I'm just doing a hot water distillation at the moment to make sure my still's clean. So I'll just run the hot water through the still until the distillate comes out clear and um, without any odour. I've already given it a, a good clean but this is just a double a double check. I have my rye, rye flour ready, my pH reader, my oil separators, my pump ready to go in the condenser bucket and my harvested rosemary. It's just a bit after the full moon unfortunately. I should have got this rosemary before the full moon but they're the fresh tips and I'm going to strip the leaves off the stems and just do the leaves only. It grows on a quite a steep hillside where it gets a very strong sea breeze and it grows in quite a rocky volcanic soil. Not very much of it is flowering and it is autumn here on Waiheke Island. Um, it smells quite sweet but it may have quite a high camp for content. I'm not sure because it's a bit late in the season. We'll see. I've stripped the rosemary and I've got a nice basket full of it. A good handful like that is about 100 grams. So I've already put two handfuls into the column. So now I'm going to go two, three, four, five. I think I'll just keep it at five and that's quite loose in there and I've probably got another two columns to go. The column is filled with 500 grams of rosemary petals and flowers. The rye flower is plugging up all the seams so I'm not going to lose any steam and I can, there's this beautiful strong smell of rosemary and yes the first flush of the distillates going to start flowing now. So I'll collect 500 mils before I put it into my large oil separator to separate out the oil. So while that 500 mils is being collected I shall go and attend to my sorely neglected vegetable garden. I now have 500 mils of lovely aromatic fresh rosemary in my oil separator so I'm going to turn the tap on and drain the water out the hydrosol out spinning out the bottom and thank the very famous New Zealander for letting me pick this lovely rosemary on my happy island Actually I can still see there's a lot of tiny little minuscule bubbles of oil. Probably didn't leave it long enough to settle so I might do it twice. So that's my yield of essential oil on 500 grams of um, rosemary. So I'll put it into a smaller measuring glass and get an accurate measure on it. I've drained the essential oil into a small measuring flask and I can see that I've got exactly 2.5 mils so that means four columns and I'll have my 10 mils and I think I've probably got just about enough. While I was pottering around that took about half an hour I think to get 500 um, to distill the 500 grams and get two and a half mils of essential oil and I'll have um, 500 mils of quite strong um, rosemary hydrosol.